I have a kitty friend, Nikki. Hi. I ran outside. I stopped charging myself just to come and pet him for her. So cute. I never got to show you guys the money. The um, Icelandic Krona. This is what it looks like. I used it for the first time today and I withdrew it like um, two days ago. So, yep. This is a thousand, five thousand, five hundred. And these are little hundred, fifty, ten, ten. I'm still not like 100% about the money because they use like um, periods and then commas. I don't know. But whatever. This is it. I have no idea how much I have here. I know originally I had like $123 worth of money. But I had to pay for my room. Well, for the next two nights, for tonight and tomorrow. So, this is whatever I have left, and I have no idea how much that is. If you do, then awesome. <laughs> Morning, guys. I completely forgot to tape anything so far, but it hasn't been that interesting of a morning. Um, I got up later than usual, but I did wake up at 3 something. I just went back to sleep after that. Um, yeah, so I'm waiting for the bus. First time taking the bus here. I'm gonna go to the mall. I was gonna go to the beach, but it's freezing, it's cold, and I was gonna walk, but like I said, it's too cold and I don't feel like freezing. So I'm gonna take the bus there. And it's supposed to be a really big mall that has like 170 stores. And um, I'm gonna hope that I find a store that has a sale and it's cheap and I can get myself a sweater or a scarf or just a thin coat or something because I'm cold. And I checked the weather and in the next place I'm going to, which I'm not gonna tell you guys yet, but I'm, I'm going to it tomorrow, I'll tell you. Um, it's cold also, it's in the 60s and raining. So I'm gonna need a coat for the next two places I'm going anyway, so I might as well just buy it if I can find it. So that's it. I never showed you guys that I'm staying right by um, this like swimming complex. I don't think I did anyways. Yeah, so everybody likes to go in there and have a dip, the locals and the tourists, but I don't know, it's cold. So this is the food court area. So this is what I got. It's some kind of noodles with soy protein and rice and I got myself an orange soda because I've been wanting to try it so I'm gonna eat my food because I'm starving <laughs> okay so I'm in the dressing room with Zara's because I saw they had a sale so I came in to try to find um, a sweater or something to wear or a jacket and the stuff here is way cheaper and if I would get it at home so I have this sweater on which I really like but somebody tried this on and it smells Bad. Like, they don't wear deodorant. There's a sweater. It's like a navy blue. And I can wear it for like winter and stuff. It's navy blue. Looks like that. It has a cutout though in the back. Can't really show it well. But, um, yeah. So, the smell is like hanging at me for the last one they have in this color. I don't want to get such a light color for traveling, but I do like this one. It's the same one as the blue, it's just beige. With the cutout in the back. They also have this in green, so I don't know, maybe you should get green instead of beige? I don't know, but the beige can kind of go with the stuff that I have in my closet. Well, in my suitcase, <laughs> just say that. Um, I think I'm going to get this one, I think it's like $25. So I'm in a bookstore, it's like the Barnes and Noble, and I'm looking to get Nana a book. So I'm looking at this one right now. It's like all about fairy tales, but in Icelandic. This is obviously, um, Goldilocks. 
And the three bears, toy soldiers, team that team stuff fasty. I guess I don't know. But I think maybe I have this one. It's simple. Not really words. She can play with it and kind of you know. She asked me for a book, so I'm so I'm gonna get her a book. But yeah, they have so many. Look at Peter Pan, The Wizard of Oz. So this one I like, it's really cute. It's like um, a kid book and it's telling you how Tommy's baking. I'm pretty sure that's what he's, it says. Or to me, is baking. And it's telling you how to bake. It's so cute, it's giving you all the steps, like take out the ingredients, take the stool. Well, this is me assuming I can read this, I don't know. <laughs> but I didn't think of, you know, telling your father to turn on the oven. It's just so cute. But then looking at these, they have these books. But they have like the fairy tales, and then they have puzzles. And that would be fun for her, because she could like take it out. And um, the thing is that, you know, she's not going to really read it. Versus this one, it's really simple, and you're just taking the magnets and putting them closed, and it tells you what kind of things they're into, like what kind of clothes they're into. Um, so I don't know, is this one better than that one? I don't know. I really like this one though. I feel like I would just get this. When I get back home, I'm gonna get the sagas. They said it's supposed to be good, so yeah, I think there's 11 or 10, I'm not sure, but they only have it in Icelandic here, so I'll have to get them back home. So this is the front of the mall, and the name of the mall is Kringlin, I think. Yeah. And I'm inside. This is what it looks like. This is my favorite kind of store. Like, a store that has a whole bunch of like home little like tchotchkes like that kind of stuff my favorite they just have a whole bunch of random things don't really make sense but you know so tchotchkes are just get random stuff but this is like a shopping bag for a neck pillow Get these things. The Dead Sea Mask. The Wetlips. And the Fleece Blanket. But I need one of these, so. Look at these cute little things. So, like placeholders. Cupcakes. Guys, my weakness. No books. I was just in that store over there, Tiger. I don't know. Anyways, I resist the urge to buy things, but I'm gonna come back when I'm on my way home, like when I'm gonna go towards the end of my trip. But I did buy this a canvas tote because I didn't bring any of mine, and I'm tired of lugging stuff around because they don't give you like shopping bags here. And if they do, they're really small. So it's only like three twenty-four. Can you tell that they love their workout stuff? Everybody's going crazy in there. I'm gonna go in and check it out, but I'm just gonna, I don't know, walk around, I guess. And I see Top Shop over there, which is really dangerous for me. <laughs> I'm trying not to spend. Look at that little ride, it's so cute. So I left without buying anything, thank God. This is really dangerous. I can't keep walking around. Look, I'm back where I started. So I'm in a supermarket trying to look for um, some kind of soy protein or something. But I didn't know they had these in Iceland. I get these in my vegan cuts box. Thank you. 
So I'm going to leave now. I figured I'd show you a little bit. I have to find my way out now. Oh, it's like a GameStop. Okay, so I'm leaving now. It's hot in here, but it's raining outside. Um, I'm tired. <laughs> I've been here for hours. Okay, so I don't know what to take. I mean, I know I have to take the 14 to go back, but the other side, like, you know how the bus stations, you go across the street, and that's the opposite way. That one has a different bus and it doesn't have the 14. And this is the only one that has the 14, but this is the one that dropped me off. So, I'm waiting for the bus to come, so I guess I can ask, because I have no idea where else I would take it, because there's no other um, stop nearby. So, I don't know. I don't know how that's going to work out. <clears throat> Look at all this crap that I bought. Again, I guess I just can't go to any mall. It doesn't matter what country it is. But, um, oh, that bag. Oh, never mind. Okay, yeah. I have stuff in here and here and here. I'll show you when I get to the hostel. Let you see what um I got. And um, I didn't really tape that much inside because it just feels like, really awkward, especially when you're inside a mall. There's so many people. And I'd rather not stick out like a tourist and just be weird in general so I didn't take as much inside but I hope to come back on my way home so because I'm going back home through um, Reykjavik again so we'll see hey, that's the mall right there it's um when you get on the bus you get off right here list the bro Hey guys, okay, so I'm back in the room. I had dinner, I didn't get to show you because there's too many people in the kitchen, but I made rice with corn together. It came out a little bit like wet, not mushy, but like wet, because I'm not used to cooking with that like instant rice thing, but it did come out good, it came out flavorful. Um, and I gave some to people that were sitting there, and they said it was good, so. Yeah, it hit like the stomach, it hit the spot because it's really cold outside and it was like really hot. Um, and I just remembered right now I have to use the bathroom. I've been holding it for a couple of hours now and I just realized, realized, I can't speak, I just realized it right now. Anyways, I'm back in the room. I have new roommates, again, but um, I check out tomorrow and in the nighttime I'm going to the airport. Oh my god, I have to use the bathroom so bad. In the nighttime I'm going to the airport and tomorrow I'm going to try to do a few stuff before I go. Oh my god. Yeah, okay. I'm going to try to do a few stuff before I go. Like, um, what do you call it? I don't know. Maybe to the pool. Because, um, one of the guys... Oh, my God. I'm oh, sorry. Okay, one of the guys was telling me that the pool that's right next to us, it's really good. And they have a lot of, um, geothermal heating little pool areas and hot tubs and stuff. And if I don't get to go to the beach because it's rainy and ugly... Oh, my God, I have to go. <laughs> then, um... I'm gonna go to that and then I heard someone talking about the library how it's really nice so I might go to that and I still want to go downtown so that means that I'm gonna get up at the butt crack of not dawn oh my god I have to go okay yeah I'm gonna get up really early and I'm probably gonna go to the pool come back so I could take a shower and have breakfast and all that stuff before I check out and then whatever <laughs> I'll tell you more about it tomorrow so I'm gonna end this here okay bye Okay, so I'm super excited because the guys told us that they're filming Game of Thrones over here because I know that they film um, 